quite tragic news really. It's in regards to this bike. Hello. But this time on Crash Test Dummy TV. <laughs> G'day all, I've got some really bad news, um, it's in regards to this bike, it's quite tragic news really, very disappointing news, kind of hit me hard and a shock um, all in one hit, um, when I just sold the bike, <laughs> no I have uh, been selling this bike for a friend of mine, it is not mine, I, I am uh, selling it on behalf of someone, um, they're uh, I wouldn't say their confidence with bikes, but they uh, they don't know a great deal about them. So uh, and they don't have the time either. You know, busy. So what I did for them was we negotiated a price, and uh, they were happy on a certain dollar, and anything above that we'd go Harvey's in. But with all the extras, I sold it um, with a 25 litre tank, with uh, the standard muffler, with the standard uh, front guard, with an aftermarket US uh, rear subframe with 180 watt, uh, sorry, 250 watt uh, stator, uh, with um, baffles, with um, oil filters, etc., 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 brake pads, the works. Um, so he's got a good deal. He's got a good deal. I won't tell you the price, but it was a very good, uh, a very good price for him um, based on market value and the extras that it came with it. And the 25 litre tank, it was a proper Cerberus, uh, one of these on the screen. And um, yeah, we, uh, well I was going to put that online anyway, but I didn't want to uh, sell that before anybody came and looked at this bike. Because it was with the bike, I figured um, it's best to at least have it hanging around for the time of the sale. Yeah, so the new owner is stoked. But yeah, tragic news, I can't ride this anymore. This means I'm bikeless. When this gets picked up, I am bikeless. I mean, I've got bikes, but none, none of them are, uh, you know, ready to go. Uh, but we're, now that I'm a little bit cashed up, I do have to put some on bills, unfortunately. But uh, I might be able to get one on the road. I'm going to have to do some figures. The cruiser, I'm uh, doing some extra uh, baffles at the moment. Seeing if I can quieten the exhaust down, so on maybe that. But the uh, the XT600 that can go on virtually uh, tomorrow. That's that's pretty much roadworthy. Um, I think there's like a, a a switch I've got to look at, or an indicator, or an earth, or something like that. There's something very simple left. But yeah, tragic news. I can't ride this around the streets anymore. I can't terrorise the neighbourhood. Oh well. Hope you've enjoyed the uh, the journey of the XR650. I'll do a little montage of uh, when it was first bought, the first wheelie out the front, the first fall in the bush. It's done. It's done. Good job. Oh, that's the other thing I'm going to give him with the sale: a can of SC SC1 new bike in a can. And I sprayed it up. Uh, showed him. I didn't want to do it because I'd yet to paint it, uh, sorry, yet to wash it after the GP run. Um, but I, uh, I didn't want to put it on there before the sale just so I could show the person on the, the day how much better it looks with it. So yeah, that's got it with it. And that's without. And that's without. So that's with. Without. You can't really tell because that's in the light and that's in the shade. But anyway, it looks better. Groovy. XR650R. I'll have to give you a total summary on this bike. What I thought of the whole thing. The journey, my journey with the XR650. I never owned this, but uh, I had a nice journey. I got to ride it, play with it, work on it, clean it, install things on it, fix things on it. Hmm... All at someone else's cost. I like that. Well, actually, I won't say someone else's cost because uh, a lot of the things I did for free just because, well, you know, I get to ride it. I get to test ride. I get to review. I get to film. Yeah. 
there's always a win-win somewhere. Groovy. Sponsors on this bike. FMF. Um, whatever the Carby brand is. The tape. The tyres. The brakes. The braided lines. The vapour dash. Which I've got to get fixed. I actually reduced the price in the sale because of the vapour dash. But he's going to drop the old one off, so I'll see if I can get the old one fixed. I'll reuse it. Apparently they're bulletproof, but it's not like resetting and not drying out what was recommended to me. Crash test on my TV. Groovy. I'm going to buy him another visor. And the guy that bought the bike is a local, so I'll be able to get him to drop this off to me, because I want to give it to the, uh, the old owner. Just so he's got something, a piece of the bike on the wall. Excellent. Groovy. Thanks for joining me. And uh, stay tuned to see what bike I'll be uh, riding next on a regular basis. <laughs> Sweet. Ride safe out there all. Sounded nice. Cool. Ride safe out there all. Speak to you soon. Bye. Nah. Yay. <laughs> we can go down the road. Flap dee, flap dee, flap. Baffled officer? You're literary. Yeah, baffled my ass. I think All you need to do is paint that red and it'll look like flames. And it wobbles, isn't it? Yeah. That's a bloopers moment there.